and welcome to PCTV News. I'm Georgia May Hurley. And I'm Lena Howe. Last weekend was the International Perspectives Conference. Team Sylvester, Buck, and Brooks won the intramurals final, and the Principia soccer teams had their senior night. In preparation for the election on November 4th, Congressman R Rodney Davis came to Principia to speak. This just in, a student went missing during last Friday's zombie tag in Crafton Athletic Center. We are uncertain at this moment who this student is and how the student disappeared. We go now to campus security where Tori Silver is looking for answers. Hello, I'm Tori Silver and I'm at campus security here with Eric. Eric, do you have any comment on the missing student situation? Yes, Tori, we have unconfirmed reports that a student was dragged out of Crafton Center. Uh, at this time, we're not sure of all the events that happened, but if you could give us a call or have anybody who has any information give us a call as soon as possible, that would be helpful. Thanks, Tori. We have just received security footage from Crafton Athletic Center showing that what looks to be a kidnapping during zombie tag. We've just received confirmation that the figure being dragged is Principia College junior Nick Boyd. Nick Boyd was last seen by friends pretending to be a zombie for a game, wearing a navy blue t-shirt and khaki pants. One of these friends is eyewitness Andy Crump. Evan Dodderman is with him now. Evan? Thanks, George May. I'm here with Andy Crump, who was at the zombie tag team the other day. Andy, what can you tell me about the suspicions of junior Nick Boyd gone missing? Yeah, I saw Nick Boyd at the zombie tag. He was hanging out by the sand pit, but he's kind of weird, so I kind of ignored it. All right, thank you. Thanks, Evan. Let's go now to our field reporter, Alyssa Winslow, who's following up with college professors on their response to the disappearance. Go. Hello, I'm here with uh, Professor John Williams. John Williams, um, can, do you have a comment on uh, the missing student, Nick Boyd? Who? Uh, the, the missing student, Nick Boyd. He's a junior. Junior. Is he a political science major? Uh, good question. <laughs> I, I don't think so. No so, it, it, is, there, is there a reason I should be concerned? Yes, uh, we have reason to believe that he has gone missing from the Principia College campus. Is there a fear that he won't return? Well, we're trying to find that out. Do you have any ideas or any um, suspicions? Well, if he doesn't return, that really messed up our enrollment statistics. Yes, we, I... We can't afford to lose a single person. All right. Well, do you have any suggestions for how we should go about or where we should look for him? Uh, what does he do? Some people you put out cheese, they'll come for it. You know, pub shakes, I don't know what attracts them. That's a good idea. I think pub shakes would probably work. Pub shakes, okay. Well, I would sprinkle pub shakes all along the sidewalk. Okay, all right. So just, you know, a hundred or so, leading him right back to campus sure. from, from the gate sure. forward. Do, do grades matter? Does he want extra credit? Oh, yeah, maybe maybe we should go check with the professor when he has this semester. Yeah, and offer extra credit. That usually brings students out of their hiding places. Okay, perfect. Uh, do you have any other uh, advice for the administration or to get the security in terms of finding him? Actually, I'd uh, keep them out of it. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much for your time, and uh, we're, we're still on the hunt for uh, missing Nick Boyd. If you are just tuning in, we are following the story of missing student Nick Boyd. He was last seen at Zombie Tag in Crafton Athletic Center. If you have any information, please contact Campus Security at 1-800-NICK-BOYD. Following this story is Lissa Winslow in the field. Lissa? Hello, I'm here with Ben Frederick. Ben, uh, do you have a comment on the missing student, Nick Boyd? Oh, it's awful. It's just awful. And why do you think it's awful? It's just awful. It's terrible. Do you, it's, it's just, it's a travesty. Do you have any uh, suggestions or thoughts of where he might be? It's just awful. It's just so bad. I can't believe something like this could happen. Well, clearly Ben Frederick thinks that this is awful. Are you guys talking about Nick Boyd? Yeah, do you have any comment? Yeah, I already uh, went to the flash mob or something. Okay, new information. We will uh, be checking in with the flash mob. Still no updates on the location or status of the missing student, Nick Boyd. Let's check in now with Tori Silver, who is combing the streets of Alton in search of Nick Boyd at the scene, Halloween Parade, and Principia Flash Mob. Well, I'm Tori Silver, and I'm at Fruz Bridal at the Flash Mob. I'm here with Austin Cooling. Austin, have you seen Nick Boyd anywhere? Um, I haven't seen him, but uh, I heard he was at the boot stamps, so I would check there. 
For those of you just tuning in, we're following the ongoing investigation into the disappearance of student Nick Boyd. Here to follow up on that last tip is Nathan Wright. I'm here at Brooke's house where the dance is going on in the room behind me. While the dance in there is lively, no students appear to be kidnapped. I'm talking here with a student I found at the dance. So, have you seen Nick Boyd here? Who's Nick Boyd? He's a missing student. I have not seen him around here. He's somewhere else. He's about yay high. Probably don't know him. You're uh, sure you're not Nick Boyd? Uh, I think so. Sorry, can't help you. Can you prove that to us? Uh-uh. I have him. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. Please, no. Don't torture me. There you have it, folks. Nick Boyd is not to be found at the Brooks dance. Thank you, Nathan. We have now confirmed that Nick Boyd is not at the flash mob or the Halloween dance in Brooks. We'll go back to Lissa in the field now for a student's perspective on this tragedy. Hello, I'm here with Abby Steckler. Abby, do you have any comments on uh, who you think might have taken Nick Boyd? Well, I think it's pretty obvious. It's definitely the Ellison clown. Ooh, why do you say that? Well, there have been disappearances in the past, and Nick Boyd was very much involved with those occurrences. Well, we will have to check in with the Ellison Clown. The case on the Elliston Clown is still not closed. However, campus security assures us that there have been no new sightings. Some students are saying that the disappearance of Nick Boyd is from the mysterious cougar on campus. Others are saying it was the Piasaw bird. Better not get too close to that sculpture, Alyssa. Looks like it's got some sharp claws. Let's try talking to students for a more conventional viewpoint. Let's go to Danny McKenzie in the field. So I'm here in Howard with student body president Susie Bonwich and house president Summer Switzer. Have you guys been aware of Nick Boyd going missing? I mean, I've been walking around and I haven't seen him. Okay. Oh, I haven't seen him at all. Do you have any idea of where we can find Nick Boyd? Well, I know he's the head of the music recording club. He might be doing Transylvania Treats right now. Yeah, Transylvania Treats is going on right now, so yeah, he really might be out there. Okay, so uh, next place to go to is Transylvania Treats. <laughs> For those of you just joining us, we're deep into the hunt for student Nick Boyd, who was presumably kidnapped last Friday during zombie tag. We'll now go to the field where Evan Dodderman is interviewing RCs to see if they have any clues to the whereabouts of Boyd. Oh, it's you. Hey, yeah. hey Dan. I was actually looking for you. Um, have you heard about the disappearance of Nick Boyd? I heard he went to the haunted house here. Is this true? Look, I, I told you, I don't know anything about Nick. Okay. But there has been something going on weird here. I think this year, the haunted house is actually haunted. Really? Yeah. So if they took him, he's definitely in there. Okay. It appears that we've lost the feed from Evan. We go now. <laughs> What's the matter, Georgia May? 